Gun Wild here and welcome to Rimfire Madness. Today we're going to take a look at an older rifle and that is the Remington Fieldmaster Model 572. The Remington Fieldmaster 572 was introduced in 1955 and was manufactured through 1988. This is a tube fed pump action 22 caliber rifle. It has a 23 inch barrel, a total length of 42 inches, and it has a 13 and 5 eighths inch length of pull. Now this rifle is capable of accepting 22 shorts, 22 long, and 22 long rifle cartridges. Let's take a look at those. Okay, here are the cartridges that uh, that rifle accepts. These are all CCI, but there are a wide variety of, of brands out there that you can get in these cartridges. Now, here's the short. This is a 29 grain bullet and it has a 1080 feet per second velocity. The next one is the 22 long. And that is also a 29 grain bullet and that has 1215 feet per second at the muzzle. And the 22 long rifle, that is a 40 grain bullet with 1235 feet per second at the muzzle. Like I said, this firearm is tube fed and the tube holds 22 of the short, 17 of the long, and 16 of the long rifle. From what I can understand from the uh, codes that are stamped into the receiver of this rifle, it was manufactured in November of 1973. Now there is a variation of this rifle that is still available through Remington and that is the uh, the BDL Fieldmaster 572. It's basically the same firearm but it's just got a few little changes to it. It has an actual 21 inch barrel, has a 40 inch overall length of pull and it has some very nice checkering on the pump action and the pistol grip area of the stock and it also has much nicer beefier iron sights now this firearm has decent iron sights on it but i chose to throw a uh, three to nine power inexpensive rim fire scope on there made by Barska. For a plinker this is an excellent firearm. If uh, you can get your hands on one of these older ones I would highly recommend you do it. They are a lot of fun. Alright guys I want to thank you for watching and we'll talk to you later. Goodbye.